Music has an Always Available search field here at the top of the sidebar. Notice that when I select it, we can search My Library, Apple Music, or the iTunes Store. So if I enter the search term Petty with My Library selected, I'm only going to get results from the songs and albums on my Mac. Click See All here to view all the songs that turned up in this search. I also get artists, albums, and playlists in these results. Switch over to an Apple Music search now and we get entirely different results, just because we're searching through so much more content. Notice that we can search Apple Music without being a member. Change to an iTunes Store search and we can now browse the songs and albums that turn up as well as purchase them. When searching the iTunes Store, you can sample the songs, which non-members cannot do in Apple Music. The search field always searches through your entire library, all of Apple Music, or the entire iTunes Store. If you just want to search through the songs that you have for specific artists or search a playlist, that can be done using the filter field. From pretty much any view, we can bring up the filter field from the View menu or with the shortcut Shift-Command-F. So if I have Death Cab for Cutie selected here in Artist View, I can then bring up the filter field and enter Bird. The song Talking Bird appears in the results. From the Albums view, I get several results if I filter the word Love. Jump into one of these albums and enter love in the filter field again to get down to the song or songs with love in the title. We can use the filter field within playlists as well. So between the search field in the sidebar and the filter field that can be activated from anywhere in your library, the music app makes it pretty easy to find whatever you may be looking for whether it's in your library or not.